Dwayne Aquina was the anchor of the Putaho football and basketball teams during the early 1970s, playing three years of each sport and winning state championships his junior and senior years in hoops. He is remembered as a gifted athlete, a proven winner, and a spirited personality beloved by coaches and teammates alike. You know, he was 6'3", probably 185, something like that. Um, and we played him at, at guard his senior year. So he got, he was fortunate to get a lot of mismatches. So we would, he'd bring the ball down the court as a point guard. And we have somebody that's like 5'9 guarding him. And we'd say, okay, well, let's, we better post him up. So we take him down low, and then he'd, he'd become like a center. And he had all these wonderful mismatches all year long. Um, very difficult to guard. The mental part of his game was probably the most interesting. Um, he did not like to lose at all. Fierce competitor. And whoever was on the other, other team we were playing that night, he didn't want to lose them. He didn't care who they were. He did not want to lose. So, so he had that sort of driving uh, competitive desire maybe in his DNA, and then, then he just built upon it and became this amazing, amazing competitor. Um, and that's really what made him, I think, um, as successful as he was, is his mental toughness. Aquina went on to play football at the University of Washington from 1976 to 1978, then remained with the Huskies as a graduate assistant coach until 1980. His hallowed coaching resume has continued to grow. He has coached six Thorpe Award finalists and three winners, and set 29 defensive backs to the NFL. The Putaho Athletic Hall of Fame welcomes Dwayne Aquina.